Hello guys, Gamer Century here, and today I'm going to show you uh, an alternate method to transferring your Pokemon between games other than the Pokebank. Now, the reason why I came up with this method is because Pokemon Sun and Moon are going to come out soon, and that could be a necessity because some people now just only own X or Y or something like that. But when Pokemon when they get Pokemon Sun and Moon, it's going to be sort of a necessity to transfer those Pokemon. So. Alright, since uh, those games haven't come out yet, I'm going to show you how to transfer them between Alpha Sapphire, Omega Ruby, and X or Y. Now, start a new save file on Pokemon X. So, um, what you're going to need to start off with is you're going to need to start off with. Sorry. You're going to need to start off with. Uh, depositing a Pokemon on the receiving game file. You don't want to uh, send it off on the on the giving game file because then it is going to be bad because you don't want to like someone else to get the Pokemon instead of your game file. So what you're going to need to do, you're going to need to open up GTS, you're going to need to do GTS and Wi-Fi and two game copies to get this method now there's another method which you need 2 DSs for it is trading like link trading but I only have one DS well, I used to have another one but it broke well whatever um so I'm just gonna do the one DS method so over here I have already done this multiple times with my Pokemon and I'm just going to show you guys so I have a couple. Let me just find a Pokemon that I don't need. Uh, but why not trade off and execute? Wait, no. Now I'm going to trade away a love disc. Actually, mm, no, what? Machop, Machop. I can get you another one. They're very common. So I'm going to deposit him. Yeah, I'm going to deposit the Machop. Now what I'm going to deposit it for is my shiny hack source of 100. So I'm going to scroll down to what Pokemon because I don't have it yet. Type in hack source. Let me just show you guys. See? Hack source. And I'm just going to enter it in. Now this does take time. So if you're going to try to trade in between like a box full of Pokemon may take you a bit longer but you cannot trade at bet legendaries and stuff like that between games using this method because of course unless they're hacked there's no way that you can trade them using the GTS. Now I'm depositing my shop and there you go. I'm just gonna quit the GTS. I'm going to save my game. I don't need to but I like doing it because Sometimes the game has like a glitch and stuff, but I just like doing it, so I'm just gonna exit out of Pokemon X. There you go. I'm gonna eject it. Okay, let me just grab the cartridge out. Oh, there you go. I'm gonna put in my Pokemon Alpha Sapphire copy. Sorry. Ugh. Okay, there you go. Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna go through everything fast. Hey, come on. Okay, there you go. Okay, so here I am. And I am going to go into the GTS. GTS. In a game. Now, something that I forgot to mention is that when you deposit a Pokemon, you might want to put in like a gender or a level, um, as well as a message for yourself that's easy to memorize. Now, I've done this before, so my message is Anna Wildfire 30, Anna, the name of my X and Y save file, uh, this character, Wildfire, the nickname of the character, and then 30, just random number. Um, 
So, of course, I have a Pokemon to the GTS, so I wouldn't I? <laughs> okay, so now I'm just gonna go for Machop. Go to M. Let me find Machop. There you go. Options don't include because Hexorus is not a Pokemon that falls into that category. Uh, sorry about the noise in the background, but here. As you can see, first one is mine, Machop for Hexorus. And just check Anna. The name in Wolf 30 and then my exact location and the exact clothes that I'm wearing in the game. So, yes, I'm gonna trade. I have no idea where my hack source is, unfortunately, but I'll find it. You know, I'm just gonna go look through it like this because it's a lot simple. Or, sorry, okay, there you go. It's a shiny box. Hack source, yes, yes, hack source. Level 100. Shiny. Okay. Sorry if the camera's a bit shaky. Okay. Hmm. So here it is. Hexor is going to the DTS. And bam! Ultimately, that Hexor jumps into my Pokemon X game. Since I'm not done my Pokemon X save file, I'm not going to use the Pokemon yet because I want to sort of like get through it with the Pokemon, not sort of cheat through. So I'm going to just leave them in the box. So I'm going to do is I'm going to quit the GDS. Going to save my file and save my game. There you go. It takes a bit longer to save because I'm trying to go to the global link, but it turned off because they're doing sort of something for the Sun and Moon. I'm gonna exit out of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. Just gonna eject it, sorry. Okay, there you go. Ejected it and putting in Pokemon X. Okay, there you go. Pokemon X. I like this method because it is very simple and easy and there's no weird glitches in it or anything. So if you just have legit shinies on it, just it works. It works. It just does. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the GTS right now. Yeah, I have to connect to the internet because there's like this thing. Once you exit out the game, you're disconnected. <laughs> Please ignore the noise in the background if you hear any of that. Yeah, so it's connected to the internet. Sorry if you hear the noise in the background. Again, it's my sister. Okay, so successfully connected to the internet. Okay, so checking the GTS status. And of course, surprise, surprise, it has been traded away. So here, got the shiny Hexorus that I got from my Office of Bargain. There you go. Okay, so now I'm just gonna do it again, just in case you sort of missed that. Okay, so you know I'm gonna pause something that I do not need. It's very common. Mm. Tons of cool. Now I'm just gonna pause the love disc. I don't need it. Plus, it doesn't have an evolution, so it's automatically in my Pokédex already. Uh, I'm gonna put it in for Ditto. Ditto. No, it's not in my Pokédex. Forgot. Okay. Got what Pokémon? I'm just gonna do this with the pad. Ugh. I'm looking at the camera instead of the screen. Well. Ditto, there you go. Um, I have a shiny Ditto level 100, so I'm just gonna go like that. And there you go, deposit with these conditions. Now I should be able to get it. I'm just gonna wait for the GTS status. Go for So then I can go to getting my Ditto shiny. Which will be helpful because I want a shiny breed. I want to breed for shinies in X and Y. I mean X, which is pretty cool. So, 
I forgot to mention I'm breeding for a shiny lotus. I know it's pretty stupid, but no, nah, I'm trying. I'm trying. I patched over a hundred eggs. It took me like not much time to patch that many eggs, but like over a hundred eggs and no shiny love disc. Can I repeat love disc? That sort of makes it a bit funny, but okay. So I'm just gonna. Oh, what am I doing? Okay. Um, I'm just go back to the game card sort of slot. There you go. I'm gonna grab my set bar copy. There you go. There you go. Okay, so uh, right here. Yep. Was that for? Stir it up. I'm gonna trade my ditto. Shiny the 100. There is an HTS. Sorry. Into my Pokemon X copy. So I'm gonna go into the GTS. Yes. There you go. Come on, loading, 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 connect to later. So yeah. This method is very effective um, if you want to transfer a couple of Pokemon over. Now, since I want to transfer like a bin or two, I have this thing and I'm going to transfer one Pokemon every day. Uh, and then by the time we'll be finished Pokemon X, it would I would have like the bin of Pokemon that I traded away. So I'm just going to go in for a love disc. Love disc. <laughs> Sorry, just had to put that in. Love disc. Options don't include. Now I'm just gonna do this. So this is mine for Ditto of 100 and all of my 30. Okay. Here I have my shiny Ditto, the 100 with Pokebus. As you can see. Trade this away, sorry. So I'm gonna breed. And this is a Japanese Ditto. 100 Pokemon, so I will be able to do the Masuda method with it. And that's gonna be cool. So can't wait for that. So there you go. Trading away my shiny Ditto. For my regular love disc. And now that Ditto jumped over into my Pokemon X game. And Pokemon X is gonna fly away until I answer it back into my DS. Okay, so there you go. Come on, load up, load up, load up. It'll be much easier to do link trades, but you don't really want to spend like that much money to get another DS just to trade over a couple Pokemon. But I'm just gonna disconnect. Yes. Okay, disconnect from the internet. Done. Save my game. Yes, I want to save my game. There you go. Um, X, okay, yeah. I'm just gonna eject Pokemon off of Sapphire, sorry, and put in Pokemon X, sorry, it's shaky, I'm trying to do my best, nothing inserted, seriously, there you go, Pokemon X. There you go. Sorry if it's a long video. Just wanted to make one like this. Okay. So I'm just gonna start it up. I got like a couple minutes left. Recording. A couple minute left. But yeah, guys. I'm just gonna do this. GTS. Yes. Okay, so yeah guys, and that is how um, you can trade Pokemon over, and I know the GTS is going to be in Pokemon, sorry, Sun and Moon, so this is going to be an effective and easy way to transfer your Pokemon from X, Y, Omega Ruby, or Alpha Sapphire to Pokemon Sun or moon 
And yeah, guys, Gamer Central.